Hi everyone. Today, I would like to briefly reflect on prayer. There are many reasons and ways to pray, and at its core, prayer is simply communicating with God. As we all know, any good communication is, is as much about listening as it is about talking. So in prayer, we find ourselves listening for God's voice, seeking direction and wrestling with his ways. We confess our shortcomings and we present to him the desires of our heart. Prayer is also about acknowledging the majesty of God, praising his name and expressing gratitude. In the midst of crisis, prayer gives us hope and solace in our fears and anxiety. We see in the Psalms how often the prayer of lament helps to name and navigate pain and suffering. And in the midst of evil, prayer is a powerful tool that helps us overcome. In whatever form it takes, prayer is an expression of worship and faith and brings us closer to God. As James reminds us in, in chapter 4, verse 8, he, he says, Draw near to me, and I will draw near to you. That's God speaking to us. Scripture also encourages us to pray for others. We see this expressed in Ephesians 3, when the Apostle Paul exhorts the Ephesian church to pray for him and for one another, and pray in the Spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests, Paul says. With this in mind, be alert and always keep on praying for all the Lord's people. Pray also for me that whenever I speak, words may be given to me so that I will fiercely make known the mystery of the gospel for which I am an ambassador in chains. Pray that I may declare it fearlessly as I should. At all times, in particular in these days, we need to draw near to God in prayer. We need to cry out for God's help as we intercede for one another. As pastors and leaders, let us pray for each other's leadership, our churches and witness at this crucial time in our history. Can I also encourage you to pray for our national and our world leaders as they navigate these unprecedented times. And pray for our world, the vulnerable and the suffering, that God will bring healing, comfort, peace and unity. I'd like to lead us in this prayer. Loving God, we thank you for your presence and for your providence. We prayerfully seek your grace amidst COVID-19 here and overseas. We pray for those in need of healing we ask for your peace for those who are anxious or grieving. We pray you will continue to sustain all those who are serving in response to the pandemic. We pray for your Holy Spirit's discernment amidst the many choices and decisions facing our world, national community and medical leaders. We pray we might each see quickly what more we can do to help those who are vulnerable. And we ask that as pastors, leaders, churches and communities of faith, we would flourish and thrive in our witness of you. We ask these things through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. God bless.